my channel. Today we're going to be doing a review on the MAC Shiny Pretty Things Lip Kit. If you do want to see a review and swatches, please keep watching. Here's what the outer packaging does look like. It comes in this pretty significant big box. And then on the back, you have the lipstick shades and the names and then some of the ingredients. When you open up the packaging, this is what the box does look like. And let's open this up. And here you have all 10 of the different lipsticks. So let's see what the first shade does look like. I love these little deluxe size lipsticks because I can never finish a whole lipstick tube unless I'm really loving the shade. And it does say MAC in the middle. Look how teeny tiny in the shade Snob. So here's what the shade Snob looks like. This shade is a light neutral pink shade and this is a cream formula. Let's see what this looks like applied to the lips. This pink shade does wash me out, but I do love the smell of MAC lipsticks, you guys. It smells so amazing. It's like that vanilla scent. It just smells really good, but this shade I'm not really a fan of. I don't really like it. It doesn't complement my skin complexion. Let's see what the next shade in the collection does look like. The next shade in the collection is called Twig. Ooh, I love this shade. This shade in Twig is a soft brownish pinky shade. I love this shade in Twig, and this is a cream formula. I love this shade in Twig. It complements my skin complexion. This shade in Twig is that soft, muted, brownish pink shade, which I love. The next shade in the collection is called Sea Sheer. All the packaging on these. These are super cute. This shade looks gorgeous. It's this grapefruit pink shade. This shade in C Sheer is a shine lipstick and this is a grapefruit pink shade. This shade I did have to go a couple of times back and forth to just build up the pigment on my lips. I'm not really a fan of this shade but I do like the formula of this shiny lipstick. It does feel very comfortable on the lips. The next shade in the collection is called Relentlessly Red. I love the packaging again, super cute. This looks like a gorgeous shade. And this shade is a bright pinkish coral shade and this is a matte shade. This shade is very bright and in your face. I really do love this bright coral shade. The next shade in the collection is called Ruby Woo. This packaging is stunning. I love this metallic in your face packaging. Here we have that beautiful blue red shade. Here we have the shade in Ruby Woo. This shade is going to be a gorgeous holiday red shade. gorgeous red matte shade. MAC does very well with their matte shades and their formula is so good. I can definitely see why everybody loves this shade in Ruby Woo because this shade is amazing. The next shade in the collection is called Show Orchid. Again, I do love the packaging on this. This is a gorgeous shade. And here we have the shade in Show Orchid. This shade is a hot pink shade. show orchid and this is a cream formula you guys know I love max cream formulas and their matte formula and I also love their powder kiss formula and surprisingly I love their shine formula as well the next shade in the collection is called rebel and you guys know I love my plum shades look how cute this packaging is it's stunning I love this purple metallic packaging ooh that's really really pretty Here we have this purple plum shade in rebel favorite shade is purple and this purple does not let me down. This is a beautiful gorgeous plum shade and I definitely think I'll be putting this plum shade to good use. 
The next shade in the collection is called Velvet Teddy. The shade in Velvet Teddy is a deep tone beige matte shade. So here we have the shade in Velvet Teddy. That's a gorgeous nude shade. I love this shade in Velvet Teddy. I actually wanted to purchase the full size in Velvet Teddy. When I saw this available on sale, online at Ulta for $59.63, I decided to hop on and purchase this set. A lot of these lipstick shades I don't have in my collection. I don't have a lot of MAC shades. I have a couple. I definitely thought that this set would fit perfectly in my collection. And I definitely think this can be an everyday wear shade for me. The next shade in the collection is called Chili. Again, packaging, super cute. Love this color. This is a brownish, reddish shade. So here we have the shade in Chili. This is a brownish, orange, red shade. is gorgeous as well it does complement my skin complexion and the last shade in the collection is called diva again gorgeous packaging Ooh, this is a burgundy shade so here we have the shade diva this shade is a burgundy shade <laughs> burgundy shade it complements my skin complexion this is so fall ready and winter ready we are currently in winter because it's December and this feels so comfortable on the lips I love this shade I love all 10 of these lipsticks in this collection I definitely do think that there was only this one shade that wasn't very pigmented but I definitely can use that shade as a lip topper it was the shade it was this shade in C sheer it wasn't as pigmented and I did have to layer it. I love the packaging on this and it's super convenient because you can just pop one of these in your purse and you're good to go. And this box is super durable as well. You can just remove this insert here and you can pop whatever you want in this. Just keep this box. You can even pop a couple lipsticks in here. Just have this hanging and you can just leave it like that without the insert and look how cute. It's definitely a cute storage box. And like I did mention to you guys earlier, this set does retail for $59.63. It was originally for $79.50. You do the math on this, you are paying $5.96 each per lipstick, which is definitely a good value in my opinion. If you guys did enjoy this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video.